First of all, I yeah. love the sneaker game. Okay, well, let's just address the <laughs> elephant in the room here. I, I, I would like to say it was intentional. It happened in the dressing room. <laughs> but it wasn't. No, it I, wasn't. So... I need to applaud the fact that you have a ripped pantyhose. <laughs> Is it singular plant pantyhose? Pantyhose. Yeah. Pantyhose? Yeah. Is it still hose or hose? But the fact that you still came out here yeah. looking like a boss. Yes! <laughs> She doesn't dress like this, but she heard you like sneakers, and she sort of just changes to whatever people want her to be. Oh, yeah. God, well, you... that's true. Yeah. Yeah. You know, and I respect that. And Thank I respect. That. I just want you to like me. I do already. Okay, good. Okay. <laughs> you too, obviously. She doesn't have... like you in these. No, I like, like you. Are, like, like, look stressed. at the slit. <laughs> You two obviously have a striking resemblance. Oh, thank you. Oh. You look, you're not twins. No. We're not twins. You're sisters. Yeah. Do people get you confused often? It happens. It happens. But the difference is, is that I correct people when someone says, oh, Aaron. I'm like, no, 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 no. It's Aaron. It's, it's Sarah. But Aaron does not correct them. And then. It takes too much time. Well, not really. <laughs> not really. It's just I don't sort know. Of, I'm not Sarah. It's people get uncomfortable. And then I'll see somebody out in the world and they'll come up to me that I don't know. And they're like, oh, hey. I'm like, mm, I don't know you. <laughs> and then it gets back to the people that Sarah's being, you know, a bitch out in the world. But it's just me <laughs> pretending to be her. No, no. People will, that will be the narrative. Like, Sarah is. A bitch. I'm like, it was Aaron. It wasn't me. Because <laughs> I'm Sarah's nice. Aaron. Mm, I think sometimes it probably is you. Right. But well, sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> so to change gears for a second, yeah. you're both the creative heads at Bumble. Yeah. Um, Bumble, y'all. I have y'all Bumble. Get out of here. Yeah. Who loves Bumble? Yes. Okay. Oh, I what like is that? that? Can I just ask a very blunt question? Yeah. Mm. What, what the hell does that mean? So we do everything from curating panels around the country to coming up with social media campaigns mm -hmm. to curating different events to... We travel a lot for them. We, we travel a lot, a lot yeah. We do a lot of stuff. Like, Bumble's really good about wanting to get people meeting on the app, but then take them out into the real world right. and, like, have them have real-life experiences mm -hmm. with each other. Yeah. And when they launched Bumble Biz and Bumble BFF, we were brought into the team to kind of help take that into the world. And so we're always coming up with creative ways to get people to get on Bumble Biz and meet new people for job opportunities and use it as a good resource. And then also Bumble BFF, we're trying to get people to be more comfortable meeting friends online because right. it, it's still kind of like there's a stigma around it. And there used to be a stigma about dating online, right. and then now it's totally normal. Of course. And the truth is a lot of people, you move to a new city, or all your friends are married and you're single mm -hmm. and you want to have a girlfriend that's like like-minded and you're like do I go on a dating app for friends but once you go on there you realize there's all these really great normal people yeah and what if you had to move to New York for your job and then you're like I need girlfriends it's 100% true I don't know if you can relate I feel like as I get older it is so much harder to make friends totally yeah. so yeah. hard to make friends yes. so thank yeah. you for that yes. yeah I will now make my friends digitally yeah I love it <laughs> uh, speaking of relationships and friendships Erin you recently Got married. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yeah. How did you two meet? How did it go down? Who made the first move? Spilled her tea? Uh, Bumble? Well, I mean, it is actually very Bumble fashion. Even though we didn't meet on a dating app, I did make the first move, which Ooh. is the Bumble slogan. So I bumbled in real life. She slid into his DMs. Yeah. Sweat. Really? Actually. Well, I wasn't there yet. Oh. Were you? Okay. I just, Do you I want don't to tell the story? No, no, no. I just, I, I felt that you were gonna skip that part, so I just don't. I'm not gonna skip that part. We, we go to the same gym. Okay. Small gym. It's like an office building, and we saw each other. We're like on the same schedule. So you see someone every morning at 9 a.m., and you're like, start to get to know them. Yeah. So I started being curious about him, and then I. Wanted to know more. What about a him. nice way of saying you were thirsty. <laughs> yes! I started to be curious about him. <laughs> so I started I start... obsessing over him. And so all I knew was his name was Simon. I didn't know his last name, what he does, how old he is, if he has a girlfriend. And he never flirted with her. He oh. was at the gym the same time as her. And you know, in the gym, you're like in spandex. I mean, you look like. Well, you, you dress know. really slutty at the gym. I do. <laughs> <laughs> And Sarah actually goes to the same gym. Thank God he never hit on her either. Can you imagine? Yes. <laughs> uh, I, I wish I could hold that over. you like, well, he hit on me first. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. I, I'm married. But, but he still, literally didn't dead. look in her direction. OK? Well, there, well, I'll tell you about Yeah. Oh, there, was there a time he flirted with I me? thought there was maybe one time he was looking at me. But, I, but I mean, probably not. Uh, but. Anyway, so I wanted to find more out about him, Thirsty. Mm -hmm. And so, so I <laughs> went on Instagram, and I found his trainer that person's account, yeah. and then I went to who that person follows, and I went and looked through <gasps> like there. Like a psycho. And I found a guy named Simon, and I was like, this has got to be him. I just want to point to the half of the audience. They're not clapping because it's funny. They're clapping because oh. they relate. Because they've done it. <laughs> Literally, I'm like, been there. Right? Yeah. Been there, done that. Amen, sister, amen. By the way, like, you what, being a psychologist, 
psychotic lands you a husband. Yeah. Like, it's crazy. It's crazy. So anyway, I get to his account because I just want to like learn more about him, and he's private. And so I was like, I've had two glasses of wine. I think I'm ready to do this. I hit request, <laughs> and I waited for him to accept my request. He gave me two days of waiting. Ooh. He now admits that he saw it come in immediately, but he's like, <laughs> I'll let it sit. And he waited two days, and then he let me in. And then, and then he still didn't make a move on me, and you'd think I would have gotten the hint by this point, but I didn't. And so then I was in the gym that week, and I was filming myself working out because it looked cute, and he was making fun of me, and I posted it, and I tagged him in it. So I really gave him no choice. What was your DM to him? Um, no. <laughs> You're such a mom that you think that that's what people say. It's sad. <laughs> Sarah's never DM'd with anyone before sexually, so she doesn't understand. I miss, I miss out on that whole world. If I had had Instagram when I was young and single, oh my god. What, okay, what would be yeah. your opening DM? I don't know. Probably something so stupid. But I would have been going in all those DMs. I don't know. Like, oh. well, no, I'm just saying there's a whole other world on social media I, that I didn't get to yeah, experience because I've been with my husband for uh, almost 14 years. So I got the eggplant emoji. Never. Oh. Well, well, I actually shame. have, like from like weird creeps. Oh, yeah. yeah, but okay. that's, yeah. <laughs> Not from people I know, and I didn't respond.